Tonight, scooter sharing, the vehicle city, getting a new mode of transportation thanks to some Kettering University graduates. Good evening, everyone. Thank you for joining us at 530. I'm Frank Turner. And I'm Meg McLeod. This new company is promising a cost-effective, fun way to get around Flint. TV5's Jonathan Jackson taking one of those electric scooters for a spin. Downtown Flint is about to see a whole new mode of transportation through these electric scooters. All started by a local company called Commute, which was created by a group of students from Kettering University. We're launching this to start in Flint to really help Flint. That's Peter Deppi, a recent graduate of Kettering and the founder and CEO of Commute. He says the goal of the program was to create a ride share that was both affordable and efficient, costing only a dollar to unlock and an extra 30 cents a minute. But he also says it encourages users to park and charge the scooters at smart charging hubs rather than leaving them on the street. The way we've set it up, if you bring it back to a hub, you'll get uh, a credit for a few free ride minutes, which is always cool. We'll have about 20 to 30 scooters out on the streets and we'll slowly increase over time as we're able to purchase more scooters and, and serve the, the community by providing more vehicles. And if you're wondering how fast one of these things can go, Peter tells me they can get up to 17 miles per hour. However, in residential areas, they'll slow down automatically. Uh, we're able to set geofences to where now if you're downtown, it slows down, maybe the top speed now is like eight or 10 miles an hour. So it's still decent speed. I mean, it's like the speed of a bike that's going through the sidewalk, so nothing nothing crazy. It is so stable, really fun to ride, almost any terrain, it can handle it. That's Peter's friend and fellow rider, James Opiola, who says these scooters already help with his travels through downtown Flint. And Peter hopes this encourages others to do the same. We see this as a great way to get young people downtown to help the local economy down there. I mean, we just all experience just a better, uh, I mean, better life just because, I mean, we have more money pumping into downtown. In Flint, Jonathan Jackson, WNEM TV 5. And the scooter ride sharing program is expected to start in the coming weeks. The first two charging stations will be placed at Kettering and in downtown Flint.